Let's check in with uh, Ryan Salazar of Broadcast Beat. This is it, the 2014 NAB show. We're in between Central and North Halls right now. The excitement this year, it's about cameras and the cloud. Let's go into Central Hall and find my top picks. All right, I'm with Dale Backus from Small HD. How you doing, Dale? Yeah, I'm great, how are you? It's, it's a great NAV so far. So tell us about your latest product. Yeah, so uh, our DP7 Pro line, the monitor line we introduced about nine months ago, uh, we're introducing a feature where we're allowing advanced color grading on the monitor. And so the cool part about it is not just are you creating grades with the incoming feed right from your camera, right. you're actually outputting that graded signal downstream as well, either wirelessly or wired. That's amazing, can we see it? Absolutely. All right, let's go see it. So as I, as I create grades, you'll be actually be able to see the effect uh, on on both of these displays, right? That's the before right there, and then there's the after. I did in like five seconds on the DP7. Oh, that's totally cool. So this yeah. is the DP7 Pro. Correct. From Small HD. Yeah. Thank you so much, Dale. All right, I've got Jeremy from Atomos. How you doing, Jeremy? Very well, very well. So tell us about, actually, by the way, we're using one of your other devices in one my, in the broadcast beat crew across Thank the show. Thanks Thank for letting us use that equipment. But this one looks different, so tell me about it. Yeah, so this is a 19, 20, 1080 screen. It's our first foray into the 4K world. And there's a few things that we solved in our other products. It was a recorder, monitor, playback deck, all in one device. So we've done that again. It's exactly a similar operating system, but for 4K. But we've added a few things. Um, our last products were either HDMI or SDI, but we've got both on this. 12 gig SDI, one of the world's first 12 gig SDI products, Genlock, um, so it can take all the 4K camera standards in. Wow. And HDMI 4K up to 30p. Yeah, this is the Ninja Star. This is HD. It, it, it follows out the ones you're using, the Ninja Blade I think you've got over there. Yes. And this is uh, basically customers who are using um, extreme sports, GoPros, etc. Second and third cameras, they don't need a big monitor. Right. They just want to record ProRes from their MPEG-based Japanese camera, which they're great cameras, but it's not the same workflow as if you're recording ProRes. Cool. So, we made a $295 screenless version of the Ninja that you're using. All right, I'm with Willis from DJI Innovations. How you doing? I'm very well, how are you? Doing great, it's a wonderful NAB. So, I've seen some of your devices before. This looks a little bit different, so tell us about it. This is the new Phantom 2 Vision Plus. It has the same kind of camera that the Phantom 2 Vision has, except it's smaller, lighter, and it has a three-axis gimbal, so you get stable video, getting 1080p up to 30 frames, 720p up to 60 frames. Amazing, and, and, and right here too, I see an iPhone, so yes. how does that work? You're able to get a live feed of the camera, so you can control all your camera functions, and record, take pictures, actually transfer the file straight to your phone, oh, and upload insane. it onto your social media website. Yeah, so, so why don't we take this thing for a spin, right? Yeah, let's do okay. it. Okay, I'm gonna step back now. Um, you know, I thought that you guys just made helicopter type devices, you know, to do these shoots, but I found out you have, it's essentially, it's a stabilizing system, right? It's a new DJI Ronin. You want me to stand right here? Oh, sure. Okay, all right. Here we go. So, with the DJI Ronin, it's a three axis handheld gimbal and it stabilizes in many ways. And if you pan the device, it has like a, a follow mode that's super smooth. Willis, thank you so much for showing us this device. It's awesome. Great. Have a great NAB show. Thank you very much. Enjoy. An awesome start to the 2014 NAB show. It's only day one. We have several more days to see the most amazing audio and video technologies in the world. I'll see you tomorrow.
By the way, where Ryan was standing is right here in front of our booth. You can take a selfie with that awesome Las Vegas sign. Just uh, come between Central and North Halls. You can find us here and tweet that picture out. It makes for a great memory from here at NAB Show 2014. Okay, let's take a look at what's ahead for tomorrow. The show floor opens at 9 a.m. We've got a lot on the docket. Let's see what's going on. A keynote.